Welcome back to Infigyan friends in this very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations. We are going to take up one radical equation challenging problem. The given problem is 4th root of x plus 1 over 4th root of x equal to x plus 1 over x. You can see there is one straight away solution that is x equal to 1. But we are here to find out all the complex solutions also. So let's get started. I will give our substitution. So I will consider let 4th root of x equal to a. So if I will raise both sides power 4, I can write x will be equal to a power 4. And from the original equation, this equation, I can conclude x cannot be 0. Denominator cannot be 0. Once x cannot be 0, so from here we can say a also cannot be 0. So let's reframe our equation. I will write a plus 1 over a equal to x. So a power 4 plus 1 over x. So 1 over a power 4. Now as a is not equal to 0, I can multiply or divide whatever I want. So now I am multiplying both sides with a power 4. Okay. Let me write here a power 4. And let me write here a power 4. So it will give us a power 5 plus a cube equal to a power 8 plus 1. Now I will consider 1 to the left a cube minus 1 and a power 5 to the right. So a power 8 minus a power 5. Now I will take a power 5 common. So it is a cube minus 1 and left hand side is also a cube minus 1. Now I can cancel a cube minus 1, a cube minus 1 or I can take all the term to one side and then take a cube minus 1 common. This is what I am saying a5 a cube minus 1 minus left hand side a cube minus 1 equal to 0. Now I will take a cube minus 1 common. So I can write a cube minus 1. Once I will take a cube minus 1 common, then in bracket it would be left a power 5 minus 1 equal to 0. And this is our most important equation. From here I will generate f equal to 0 or g equal to 0. So I can write a cube equal to 1. That means we are going to find out cube root of unity. And second equation is a5 equal to 1. We are going to find out fifth root of unity. So one by one we will solve and we will find out our solutions. So let's begin with a cube equal to 1. I will write a cube equal to 1. 1 I can write in the exponential Euler's form e raised to the power i 2 pi the principal solution. Now this is equal to a cube. This is principal solution. I want to write general solution. So I need to consider plus 2k pi also. And then I will put like this where k belongs to 0, 1, 2. By putting k equal to 0, we will get one root. By putting k equal to 1 and 2, the other two roots also. So overall three roots will be there. And we know that cube root of unity is 1 omega and omega square. So it will come for sure. So let's find out how it is. So I will consider a equal to e raised to the power i. I will take 2 pi common out and let me write cube here. 2 pi common out. Then I will write here what is left k plus 1. Now I will put one third or cube root both sides. So a will be equal to e raised to the power i times 2 pi over 3 times k plus 1 where k belongs to integer 0 1 2 i have to put over there so let me put k equal to 0 k equal to 1 and k equal to 2 in this manner so 0 1 and 2 see what we will get a okay if i will put k equal to 0 here so I will write here e raised to the power i 
टू पाई ओवर थ्री नाउ वट इज ई रेस टू द पार आई टू पाई ओवर थ्री लेट मी डिमोन्स्ट्रेट हेयर इट इज कॉस टू पाई ओवर थ्री दैट मीन्स वन ट्वेंटी प्लस आई साइन वन ट्वेंटी सो इट इज माइनस वन ओवर टू प्लस रूट थ्री आई ओवर टू सो इफ आई विल कंसिडर लाइक दिस देन इट इज माइनस वन प्लस आई रूट थ्री ओवर टू एंड दिस इज अवर ओमेगा ओके सो वी कैन सी दिस इज माई ओमेगा नाउ सेकेंड टर्म बाई पुटिंग के इक्वल टू वन सो आई विल राइट ई पार आई फोर पाई ओवर थ्री टू टाइम्स टू सो फोर पाई इफ आई विल पुट के इक्वल टू थ्री आई विल राइट के इक्वल टू टू आई विल राइट सिक्स पाई ओवर थ्री एंड दिस इज अवर वन बिकॉज दिस इज ई रेस टू द पार आई टू पाई एंड विच इज इक्वल टू वन now if the same time if i am interested to find out x value also so x is a par 4 we considered root fourth root of x equal to a so x is equal to a par 4 so i will write e raised to the power i 8 pi over 3 e raised to the power i consider here power 4 so 16 pi over 3 and third term i will write e raised to the power i 24 over 3 okay so this value is omega this value is omega square and last value you know this is 1 how it is i 2 pi over 3 whole power 4 so i 2 pi over 3 is omega so this will give us omega power 4 and omega power 4 is omega So which is same both values are identical let me demonstrate a bit e raised to the power i 2 pi over 3 whole power 4 the very first value this is our e raised to the power i 8 pi over 3 so we can write this is omega power 4 which can be further written as omega cube times omega omega cube is 1 so omega that is why omega similarly the second value omega square third is obvious so there are three solutions so if i will write solution x is equal to 1 minus 1 plus minus i root 3 over 2 one is omega another is omega square cube root of unity is done now come to fifth root of unity equation was x power 5 it was in a a power 5 equal to 1 same job same way i will write e raised to the power i 2 n pi first i will write 2 pi and then for general solution i will write 2 n pi where n belongs to integer 0 1 2 3 and 4 total five values okay i will consider here e raised to the power i in bracket it is 2 pi common then in bracket i will write n plus 1 left hand side is a power 5 consider fifth root both sides so a will be equal to e raised to the power i 2 pi over 5 in bracket n plus 1 now i will consider the same job again i will make one chart i will consider here n 0 1 2 3 4 then i will consider the value of a then we will figure out value of x through a power 4 what is a n equal to 0 so this value will be i times 2 pi over 5 n equal to 1 so e raised to the power i 4 pi over 5 n equal to 2 so i will write e raised to the power i 6 pi over 5 n equal to 3 8 pi over 5 n equal to 4 so it will become here i am putting 4 4 plus 1 5 5 times 2 10 pi over 5 and we know that 10 pi over 5 this value will give us 1 because i 2 pi or 2 i pi now let us find out a power 4 so i will write directly here i 
take the power. So we have to multiply with 4. 8 pi over 5. Second value I will write i. 16 pi over 5. Third value I will write i. 24 pi over 5. Fourth value i. 32 pi over 5. And last value you can see I will write e raised to the power i 40 power over 5. So last value is our real solution 1. Rest of the value either you can put like in this order or in the Euler's form cos theta plus i sin theta or you can write in the in the same way right now it is exponential way. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care.